Welcome to Jesse Tries. Today I'm gonna try Mr. Beast Original Chocolate Bar. No, this is not milk chocolate. This is just original chocolate. I actually bought two of these. One original, one milk from a Walmart. It caught my eye. What caught my eye was the Mr. Beast part, though. It looks very 1980s, so that's why I bought. And I was born in 80s, 1984. The reason I bought, the reason I bought both of these because one says original, one says milk. And I can't tell the difference. So hopefully, tasting them will. It, it smells like and looks like dark chocolate. And look, it has the word devour printed in there, like imprinted. All. And there's the word share. <laughs> I'll take this part off. Didn't get all of it, but that's good. I'm on a diet. Yeah, another reason why I bought these because they're healthier than regular chocolate bar cook. Well, one thing, this one only contains four ingredients and has less sugar than the other ones. It's some smooth and velvety, aside from the bumps and ridges, but those were, but those are intentional, so as for taste, I think this is dark chocolate. It does certainly taste like dark chocolate. It still tastes good, milky, and chocolatey and tasty. Then why can't you just call it? But why does why not just call it dark chocolate then instead of original chocolate? After all, it does have the same look, feel, and taste of dark chocolate. Why not just call it dark dark chocolate? It still tastes chocolatey, milky, smooth, and delicious. But why not call it dark chocolate instead of original chocolate? Is dark like a bad word at that place? Or I don't know. It still tastes good. Tastes it still tastes good as the lean brands of chocolate bars, regardless where it's dark or milk. I give this an A plus, an A plus.